The best piece of advice I can give you is something you've heard for a real long time. Hey y'all, how you doing? This is Connor, you're watching thrivingminimalist.com. This year I'm going to be traveling Thailand to Peru, to California, Rhode Island, Massachusetts, New York, Texas. I'm probably going to be going to some other places internationally, maybe Mexico, maybe Costa Rica. All these places I'm going to, I'm going to be teaching acrobatics. I'm also going to be giving workshops on self-love, developing passion, and inciting growth. I spend a lot of my time online as a lifestyle coach and also as a therapist. And I get to work with incredible people that are really interested in finding themselves, in learning about themselves, in developing self-knowledge and self-love. The lifestyle that I'm living is perfect for me. It is absolutely humbling, shocking, surprising, and beautiful that I get to live this life. And I've created it for myself. And it's taken a while. And part of the reason that it's taken a while is I didn't know exactly what I wanted as I was creating this life. So about three and a half years ago, I changed my whole life around. A relationship ended. I let go of my house and my things and my belongings. I quit my job. I just changed everything. I didn't really know why. <laughs> I really wasn't sure but I knew that the life that I was living at the time wasn't working anymore and I wanted to feel more I wanted to feel more excitement and joy and freedom and passion in life I didn't know at that time that I could actually sustain it that it would be something where I could make money from it but that's what I do I make money from my lifestyle I make money from my passion I coach people every single day who want to make money online or want to make money and and have freedom to work from home. The idea of making money online or making money from home is a beautiful idea, but I think the point might be being missed just a little bit. The goal is not to make money online. The goal is to have more freedom and to live a life of passion. So what I tell people that I coach and what I wanna share with you is to really seek out your passion, to believe in yourself, to find what is really pulling you in this life and to go after it. If you go after your passion, you are going to inspire and incite awe in other people. And in that space, there is plenty of money to be made. There are a lot of programs out there that teach you how to make money. And that's that's great. I think that's a wonderful place to start if you're interested in it. But they are teaching you how to make money like someone else made money. You can make money on your passion. There is no job out there that will give you as much motivation as following your passion. If you follow your passion to make your income, you will have the excitement, the inspiration, and the drive to get things done like you have never known before. It's taken me three and a half years to really feel like I'm making money from my passion or from my lifestyle. I suspect that it might take you a little bit of time. Have patience with that process. Just because you want to start a YouTube channel and a blog and make all your money online, it doesn't mean that you have to do that today. You can go slowly. And I would recommend having patience with this process, especially if you're a little unsure what your passions are. Give yourself some time, give yourself some space to figure out what you want to do in this world. You may want to work with someone like a business coach or a lifestyle coach. You may want to work with someone like me to help develop some passion, to help discover who you really are, to help develop self-knowledge and self-love. There are a lot of people out there who are inspiring and motivating and who can help you one-on-one. -on -one. And I would recommend doing that if that sounds good for you. I would also recommend looking at some books and some videos and some websites that are how to make money online. Not so that you can miss mimic those, but so that you can gain some clarity on what you want and what you don't want. Ultimately, this is going to come down to what you want to be doing. Where do you want to put your energy? What do you want in exchange for it? I couldn't recommend enough writing down all of this stuff. Where do you want to be in five years? What do you want to be doing? Who do you want to be hanging out with? How much money do you want to make? And how can you make it happen? There's no one in the world that can do it like me. And there's no one in the world that can do it like you. The best piece of advice I can give you is something you've heard for a real long time. Time. Be yourself. Much love to you guys. Thanks so much for all the recent subscriptions. Click the like button down below if you like the video. Please leave a comment. I love getting back to you all. Much love. Take care. See you next time.
my minimalist apartment here in Austin, Texas. What I'm packing for my, to be married, I used to own a house, I used to own a rental property, I used to work a 60 to 80 hour uh, job.